What's up guys, this is Jeremiah James. I have got an easy guitar lesson here for you, easy in quotations, on Stay Awake by Dean Lewis. Uh, it's going to be tough if you're finger picking. It's a good song if you are learning how to finger pick, and I'm going to break it down nice and easy for you. So before I get started, I've got super exciting news. I have released my first single called Rest of My Days. It's available now on cdbaby.com. It's coming on iTunes and Spotify. It just takes a little bit of time for them to square away my new account, etc. Uh, so it will probably be a few weeks before it's actually available on iTunes and Spotify. But for now, I'm going to put the links below to my CD Baby page. And if you guys listen to that and like the song, do me a huge favor and support me as an artist by purchasing it. I'd really appreciate that. Um, second note, I've got a tutorial out for Chemicals and Be Alright by Dean Lewis already. So I'll put those in the card above. Um, and then we're going to just break down this song piece by piece. Okay, so we've got three parts. We've got this part. That's the first part that's played throughout most of the song, so that's the most important one to get down. Then we've also got this one. That's the second part, and that's played as a pre-chorus, I think twice in the song. And then there's this bridge uh, section, which goes like this. Those are the three parts. We're going to walk through the first part. Starting now, I will put the tab up and try and walk through as slow as possible. Alright, so this first part, we're going to start on a D chord. And we're going to pluck these three strings. That is your D string, your G string, and your B string. I'm using my thumb to pluck that D string, my index finger to pluck the G, and my middle finger to pluck the B string. And then I'm plucking the G and the B again have to do the palm mute, you can let it ring. That would sound like this, but if you add the palm mute in there, it sounds like this instead. From there, after you do that palm mute, you are going to pluck your D string again. So that sounds like this. Then we're going to switch over to a G chord, and now I'm plucking the low E string with my thumb, G and the B with my index and my middle finger. You can let it ring or you can do the palm mute. Um, and then you're going to pluck that one more time after your palm mute. So string that together, we've got D, palm mute, go to your G chord, palm mute, pluck one more time. Okay, so after you pluck that G chord one time, uh, you're going to transition back to your D chord, plug those same three strings, the D, the G, and the B, and then you're going to move over to an A chord and plug the A string, G, and the B string out. Okay, so that sounds like this. One more time here. Okay, so that's the first part. Then we have the second part. So I'm just going between an E minor chord and an A chord. And I'm plucking the E, G, and the B on my E minor chord. So that goes pluck those three simultaneously, let it ring for a second, and then pluck your G, B, G. Go to your A chord, now pluck your A, G, and your B simultaneously, and alternate from G, B, G, and 
that's it. And you can do that twice. And it transitions right back into this part. Um, and then, so now you pretty much know how to play 90% of the song. But there's one piece you're missing, which is this part. part goes like this. I'm on my E minor chord. You can either let it ring. I would like to let it ring for a second. And then palm mute. Go to your A chord. Do the same thing. Let it ring for a second and palm mute. Go to your D chord. Pluck those three strings as indicated up on the tab. Uh, and then we're going to pluck our D and our E string, our high E string. Second time, it's the same thing, E minor, A, and hold it on the D, and he does that progression twice. So that, again, sounds like this. And that's all there is to it. So that's how you play Stay Awake by Dean Lewis. If this helped you, give me a thumbs up, let me know what I'm doing right. If you have other suggestions for tutorials, I'll do my best to get to them. Um, if it didn't help you, give me a thumbs down, comment below, let me know what I can do better because I am listening and these tutorials are for you guys. So, hopefully this helped. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you for watching.